Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to get free movies and then upload them on iTunes for your iDevices. So first of all, let's go on Safari and we're going to enter a link called Pirate Bay, which I have it saved right here. You can go, there are many different things here. If you were to click on top 100, music you can download video, applications for many systems, games, porn, and other. <laughs> so what I will do is go on movie since I'm showing you how to get movies onto your iTunes and then these are all the movies you can download but first you need to download something called a BitTorrent client so go on Google or you can click the link in the description and type U torrent download and install this one or bit torrent and download and install this one. Let me see which one. <laughs> yeah, I have bit torrent. That's my most commonly used one. I don't know. I just think it's faster. And you can download any any movie here. There are a lot. But these are these are only the top 100. I'm pretty sure. So after you download it, it would automatically appear in this BitTorrent site. And after you download it, it again it will be in the downloads. And then you just drag it into your movies here. I have uh, for The Sitter, Grown Ups, Cars, and Return of the Jedi for Star Wars. So now you can't just drag this, well I can, but before they were in AVI or other formats. So you can't just drag them on your iTunes. So this is what I do. I open iTunes, uh, movies, so as you can see I have many movies here and Big Bang Theory, a show, the latest one. So basically how do you get them on here? You download a, a software called Handbrake. Right here, this is Handbrake. We, you need to download it from the internet. So the link will, again, be in the description. Or you can search up Handbrake. Mac. And download this. 64-bit, download that. And after you download that, here, why don't we try opening handbrake open automatics automatically uh, opens a something like a finder and asks you to search something you want to convert into the mp4 file because iTunes only accepts mp4s or mpeg files so here it will be in my movies let's just do Return of the Jedi and you can change many things here mp4 um, average by trade I usually don't touch these stuff you can change the audio subtitles advanced and chapters so there are many different um, things you can change so what I just do is just click start and wait until it finishes so again you can see that the icons right here so it appears on your de desktop and it's gonna take about 11 minutes and 40 seconds because this file is pretty big let me check oh that's slow it's 734 megabytes but I'm not sure why, is it, why it takes so slow this time so I don't really care And it's in perfect HD format. So now what you do is just drag it to your iTunes. And after you your and after you drag it on your iTunes, for people who have the seventh generation iPod Nano, fifth generation iPod or iPad, whatever you have, connect your iPod 
into the connect your iPod with the computer. So currently I have an iPad and an iPod Nano. So right now what I'm gonna do is connect my iPod Nano to my Mac. So here it's connected. This is mine, and these are my movies I have, so as you can see, you can change it here, sync music, I made it to sync music, movies, I sync movies too, and TV shows, you can sync many things, so what you do is click sync but before you do that make sure you check mark sync movies and check mark the movies you want to sync so right now it's starting the sync and it's done and if even if you don't check this don't sync movies right let's apply that Now I have no videos here, no movies. Yeah, I checked out my iPod, no movies. So another way you can do this is go on your movies. You have these. Uh, for example, I can choose Grown Ups, and basically what I can do is, is just drag it here. Drag it right here. And let go of the, your mouse. And the iPod is syncing. It's in the middle of syncing now, so do not disconnect. And I can drag these two. What did I drag just now? Uh, grown up. So I can drag the sitter and cars too. Both in here again. And that's just going to take some more time. Damn it. Thinking. So now you can see my movies. These are all checkmarked because these are all synced again. And you can see here, video 2.1 gigabytes out of my 16 gigabyte capacity or 14.72 to be exact. So that's basically how you do this. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hey, Macklemore, can we go thrift shopping? What, what?